With Murdoch dead and the shrine in our possession, all we have to do is go inside and seize whatever stuff we can get. Welcome back to more Fire Emblem The Binding Blade, as it says on the screen. Roy ventures into the depths of the Shrine of Seals. Apparently, the shrine contains more than just the Binding Blade. However, Paris, one of Murdoch's best commanders, waits for Roy within. Now, if you took longer than 30 turns to clear that last map, this guy would have popped out and you'd have had to fight him as well. And that would have been the signal to say, hey, you fucked up. So, this map, you only get to bring 10 units in, but you go left, right, up, down, through here, and around there. So again, there's another gimmick to this. However, thankfully, this is the last guy in the map, so thank God for that. Okay, so what's the gimmick this time round? Traps. Loads and loads of traps. You are going to be dealing with lots of stuff that's just going to be popping up from the ground and spewing from the walls. Like, you had those, um, you had those stupid, um, poison vents in, um, where you were getting the axe. Now we've got stuff like, I don't know, exploding tiles? I believe that's a thing in this chapter. Exploding tiles, how about that? Um, and, and, um, spears that pop out from the sides. So that's not going to be pleasant. However, in, um, in, in return for this, uh, I do get to say one thing. Actually, wait, not say one thing. We get to do one thing. However, I need to pick who I want to bring in. I want my flyers to go around because they'll move around quite quick. Then again, hmm. Huh. Now, here's the thing. I bought a lot of boots in the last chapter. How many did I get? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 boots! <laughs> I could theoretically make someone move 22 times further than they can normally do. I could make Roy a super unit if I wanted to, but I won't because I'm not stupid. Huh. So what do I do like this, huh? This is interesting. I, I want to give boots to these two, as well as give you stuff. But again, we can't use items here. It sucks so hard. Um, it's also a speed issue that I have. Technically, you are the one who needs speed the most, but you will be gaining it very easily, so that's not a big issue. I would like to bring... Okay, you know what? Uh, Chlorine. Actually, wait, there's probably a good good chance to build up some supports between units who still don't want to talk to each other, so I'm going to bring in Rutger, um, so he and Chlorine can try and get together a lot, get, um, get together, get along better with each other. Um, Chad, maybe I can bring, um, maybe I can bring someone else instead. I would want to bring Faye in because we, we are coming to the point where I would want to use her for stuff. Um, let's look at these levels of ours. We've got 16, 6, 7, 6, 7, 10, 7, 2. Eee. Could fix you up a little bit. Um, 5. Okay, so... Then again. There are loads of bow users here. I, I believe. If I recall correctly, there are loads of boogies. Oh, also! Oh, I almost hit the button again, jeez. Um, also, these chests are rigged. Randomly, you may get an elixir. Alternatively, you may get a dragon. And by a dragon, I mean a friggin' manakeet. Yes, the full deal. So, you have to be very careful. You just have to pray to God that you don't get a manakeet instead. In which case, I think Faye should go on one side and deal with that, whereas Lilian can go on the other side and deal with the other mannequins that might pop up. Um, I think, honestly, this is as good as it gets, so... So in that case, I guess I should just outfit you guys with good stuff. Um, now, it comes down to how many... How many boots do I want to give people? Um, you might not need that. I don't think we might need that anymore. Take out some 
Actually, you need the energy rings. God damn it. Roy, you're not useful. Um, you can hold some other stuff, right? Uh, yeah, you don't even need a rapier. You don't, um, so hold all these for people to use. Be useful for once. Um, same with you guys. Actually, maybe we can get... I'm gonna probably make... Actually... Uh, trade. Actually, no. Go to transfer. Put that back in. Take out whatever thing you just put away. What was it? It was a silver lot. Okay, um... Go have the others hold stuff for you guys. So you can take it off of them and use it there. I don't know who should use a speed wings though. Now when it comes to boots, I wonder who should have what. Maybe I should give some to the horsebound units. Also depends on... Ah, man, it's hard. Hard to figure out these things. How many units do I want to absolutely and utterly break? You know, you can hold one as well. Uh, you don't need to hold two lockpicks. Put that away. Um, let's see. Chlorine, you don't need to sleep anymore. I think there might be some nasty stuff coming our way, so... Pick that up. I know that's going to break, but I don't imagine we need it any more than that that many times. Uh, let's see. Okay. Boots, I'll probably give all the boots to, say... Okay, not all of them. I'll give probably two to Tate, two to Shanna, one to Melody. Um, so we have, like, super flyers, and, um... Hmm, that would leave... Maybe give one to Clarine, so that would be yours. Then how many do we have left? We'd have... If, I, if I'm right, three left. So, let's see. We have... We're hold, okay, we're holding seven right now. One, two, three, four, five. That would be five of them. So we'd have two left. Um, give one to Corrine. Uh, who else should hold... Who should hold the other... Uh, would I make Roy use one? I don't think Roy really needs to hold one. Then again, yeah, you can make seating stuff a little bit quicker. Um, in terms of horsebound units, we've got Shin, Lance, and Alan. They could probably hold a few of those later. We'll figure it out. Um... Yeah, we'll figure it out. And Tate needs to use that. Uh, in terms of the speed wings, I haven't figured out who I want to give that to. 14, 23, 24, 19, 25, 20. Jeez. People say you're bad. Look at that. Um, 8, 17, 17, uh, 23, 15, 19, 19, 18, 17, 9. That's to be expected. 26, 23, 22, 19, 14. Might give it to Wade. Then again, Roy is pretty slow himself, but that's he's going to be promoting soon, so not a big issue. Should I give it to Faye? Nah. Probably best to give that to Wade later. Um, oh, I guess you can do this for us, Faye. Take out the... Don't, no, don't sell the Silver Card. I want to sell the cre uh, Knight Crest because we don't need it. Bye-bye, Knight Crest. Boop. Done. Um... Huh. You could hold more boots, but what would be the point of that, huh? Let's see, there'll be, there's three in the convoy. I'll give that one, one to each of these guys, I guess, for later. Um, that would have used up five. So we'd have two here. One goes to Clarine and another... I don't want to give Clarine two friggin' boots. That would make a two, two, that'd make a move too far. Um, maybe give one to Rutger. Then that would make Deke... Um, Inferior by comparison. But I want to give one to Bors just so he can catch up better. Or, no, let's give one to Faye actually. That's a good idea because she she, she has trouble moving, so there we go. Uh, this should work. Hopefully, I, I, I hope this is going to work. Um, I think your items are fine for now because I, I restocked everything last time. Uh... Should be all fine and dandy, I guess. Except... No, actually, no. Just keep using those steel swords. Okay, check map. Let's divvy up this team properly. One side will go... We'll go of Roy to there. 
Well, another side. Let's see. Yeah, one. Okay, one thief per side. I think because wait, who's more viable as a fighter? Eight, nine, seven. Two. I think honestly, Chad is actually inferior as a, as a fighter. So keep him on that side because he he might need some protection. Um. Okay, so Lolina will go this side. Uh. Oh man, I should have brought Ellen, but I don't think there was space to bring her with us. Which case, there's a healer on that side, so we need to. Okay, would that work? Yeah, because I need one one powerful per side. Um, let's see, one, two, four, five. One, two. So both flyers on this side, along with that, and flyer. Made... Okay, this this might work. Wait, are you holding the correct stuff? No, you're not. Um, who's got all the... Okay, you should probably switch this around so this will work. Because I don't want to spend too long at the beginning getting this to work. Uh, Faye, trade with Chad. Give him those. So, um, now... It comes to... Let's see. You can give two to the... Two, two, and then abilities already on that side where... She pick up one from him, and Karin could pick up one from Astor. Wait, hold on. Isn't there more on this side? Oh yeah, because I gave one to Faye. Uh... Well, oh, man, I have to do another count. Okay, so... Faye is holding one for a reason, so is Lelina. Okay, so ignoring that... We have... We're well, holding six right now. Two, 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 one, one. And you are holding both. Okay, fine. I've done. I've done. I've done, I've done the count. Okay, should be fine then. This should be all okay. So next time on Fire on the Binding Blade, we're gonna go reveal what this Elder Revelation is. See you then.